got anything going on here. So this magnet I put on specific, we'll try, do an arm test. How's your arm doing here? Good? Mm -hmm. Okay, so if it starts to go, just let it go. I'm going straight into the forehead. Now I'm gonna go up here on the parietal bone. I'm going over here on the temporal bone. Turn your head that way so they can see a little more. Okay, great. And then we're going here on, oh, that's on the occiput. Now when a magnet is on the occiput, that's saying we have a serotonin imbalance. Now there's points for this. The bladder one, which I can touch or she can, if that goes weak, it's saying we might have a deficiency. Hold as they push, and it does. If it would have been kidney 27, that would have been excess serotonin. Okay, so this here, and then we show how to balance it biochemically. So one of the things I can uh, check is tryptophan. Now there's another interesting thing, is every, neuro, uh, every amino acid has a point on the body that we show you to find out if it's deficient. So right here again, this was uh, weak so serotonin. Now, so we can check here, and let's check stomach one. Now you touch the eye right up here, uh, right inside there, and see right on the inside over here. So she's on bladder one, that's an acupressure point, and that's going weak. So I'm gonna see if this clears it. And that's the amino acid for tryptophan, which is stomach one. So that could be a factor. Now another thing, let's go back to, we're gonna do put this in circuit. Now this is a really valuable tool. For some of you, you've already been in my classes, you'll know how you can always benefit by having a hand free when they separate the feet 18 inches apart when something that we're testing then goes on the biocomputer screen. So I'm gonna to touch back here, and when it goes weak, you just step out with your left leg 18 inches, okay? All right, and great. So now that she's done that, I don't have to hold that anymore, right? So we go back to the finger modes. I use these all the time and throughout sessions because back to the holistic model of good hearts, well, <laughs> it's everybody's, in health is structure. We need to do something structural. Okay, then um, this would be, and we'll see, that might be exercise. Now this is nutrition, yes. Emotional, oh boy, we got them all. Let's try one more, energy. Now that's where I can find the priority. So this time, when it's strong, if it's a priority, it'll go weak. So watch this. Okay, so this is strong, I'm gonna add the priority mode, and she could touch a mode too, it doesn't matter. That didn't change, that didn't change. Oh, nutrition changes actually, and then here. Okay, now, so this is interesting. What I could check is if the, the vial for candida, or there's a candida mode, I can also apply that, that's like this, where the thumb, um, I'm touching the thumb halfway between the priority mode and the pad that I'm doing here. So let's see what happens. So this would be, okay, clearing candida. So the candida then is a factor that's possibly throwing your serotonin off. So do you have any anxiety, any sleep issues, any say, low moods, anything like that going on? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, like I I always have to like triple check things. Oh, OCD. Uh, uh, when you're obsessive compulsive, being compulsive, that's low serotonin. So this is, could fix that. See, that's what's so great. Not only physical like challenges are helped by the biochemical, but psychological, especially the neurotransmitters, okay? So we can check um, again. I can go back to our diet addition, yes. Okay, so addition of, do you have turkey ever eat, like organic turkey? Turkey? Not so much? Like okay. on holidays? Well, could be a, every day could be a holiday. <laughs> Let's see, so um, organic turkey. Yeah, see that's high in, in uh, tryptophan. So high tryptophan foods, and there's more there. How about uh, essential fatty acids? 
That's another good thing. So we have a whole list in the course of all the nutrients for each of the neurotransmitters. Just wanted to give you an idea that you can zero in on what's going on with people and then balance the priorities as well as giving them a home program so that at the end of the sessions we do the home programs. So that's where um, we'll do a couple things right now. Let's also see, um, because, now watch this, she's got a, a, the magnet straight in. When I touch here, this is the acupressure point that she could tap. Now I also do this. Whenever you can't fall asleep easily, you want to tap here. may not want to do it right now. I don't want you falling asleep on me, but, but you would tap there. And you could also do this. If you start to feel compulsive about something, you can tap there, kind of like the rhythm of a ticking clock. And as you tap, it will help boost your serotonin. So that's the energy circuit for that. So we've got some foods. We can do some supplements. Um, let's see if I have some other things here. Let's see. And, and we could do the neurolymphatic reflexes too. So because she's got this in circuit week, I can touch neurolymphatics. These are for the brain. See, that goes strong. See, whatever you touch, when a weak muscle goes strong, it says, ah, that'll help. Let's check your liver too. So touch the uh, five, six, right where the, there. So that's to see if that helps. Yeah, that'll help the serotonin. And back on the small intestine. You touch right there. Well, you can touch it with this hand, and then I'll test here. See if that helps. Oh, and it does. So those are three things we're gonna do. So you rub that point again here, and I'll rub here, and we'll see if that clears it. These points are gonna be a really good thing for you to do. Is it tender there, by yeah, the way? It's really tender up here. Okay, That's so that good. these two are really gonna help. Probably clear out some of your uh, compulsive, uh, <laughs> you know, challenges okay so let's get you doing that at home and then we're going to do some um are you willing to do those dietary changes we mentioned some of the foods we oh, tested the earlier it's really hard for me to do but i don't eat it well, i've been eating it less though okay well we can look for healthier cheeses so do you like let's just check you and you can bring your food back together i'll show you one other way you can do this and then i'll show you self-testing feet together now so Let's even check what we did so far. Did that help? I'm going to go back with the magnet. Oh, and now it's strong. So that shows you when you fix something, it'll, it'll now test strong that was testing week before. So now I'm going to touch right back here. This affects the vagus nerve right at the back of the neck. And I put two fingers there, and then I'll mention a food. So let's have sharp cheddar, OK? Goat cheese. Those are good. And you were having, which cheese were you having? Well, I also eat, a, it's an organic queso cheese, and then I also eat these mozzarella sticks, but maybe it's the mozzarella sticks. Okay, well, let's check. So mozzarella sticks, hold there. That's weak. And then with the, um, was it? It's like a queso, it's an organic one. Queso? Yeah, it's an organic queso. Think of that cheese, and that's strong. See, oh, so, so that's yeah, okay, strong. great. 